Hey guys, just like to ask if you could like and subscribe and comment on the video with any thoughts you might have had because it goes a long way towards helping support my channel. Thank you. Hello and welcome back to the Walking Dead final season. Uh, we'll be hopping into episode two, Suffer the Children. All right, so so last time, um, Marlon, the leader, had turned out to be, um, had made a deal with the people that the raiders that were nearby in the past to give away, um, he was both the twins, I think? I, I don't know. I don't, remember, I'm, I don't remember if it was both twins or not, but it was the twins. Gave them over to them, but, um, kept it a secret so that, you know, nobody, obviously people would get very mad. And that would kept them safe for a while. Um, then, a. Uh, Brody ended up dying after they were covering it up, and they were planning to give uh, us away uh, to, to them instead to keep the people safe. But, um, <laughs> little dude over here said, fuck that, and shot him in the head. So that's where we're at with, with that, that plot was to the end. I probably didn't justify the... <laughs> The recap. They'll probably do better here. Previously we'll see. on The Walking Dead. Yeah, previously on The Walking Dead. Tell me how it went. AJ and I had been searching for a long time. We really had? For some place we could call home. Just when we thought we'd found a huge stash of food, it turned out to be a trap. That could have been the end. It really could have. But I woke up and found I'd been saved by a guy named Marlin. The leader of a community, living inside an old boarding school. He had quite the mullet. It felt like a chance at having a home. A real one. We had to go back to the train station to see if any food survived the explosion. We just had to. But someone else had the same idea. I didn't want to risk it. So I let him take some of the food and leave. I found Marlon and Brody in the basement that night, arguing about the man we'd seen. And I learned why Brody was so afraid. The man was part of a group of raiders they'd run into a year ago. Marlon traded Tennessee's older sisters to the raiders to keep himself safe. He attacked Brody and locked me in the basement with her. When she turned, I had to stop her. Marlin stole AJ's gun and tried to convince them I had murdered Brody. Violet backed me up. Thank you, Violet. With everyone against him, the fight went out of Marlin. I didn't know what to say to him. But then... Marlin was dead. And AJ pulled the trigger. He remembered what I'd taught him. To always aim for the head. And now we're going to have some really tense fallout to that, I imagine. Let's see where things go. <laughs> Alright, episode two of the final season. We're getting there, guys. We're getting there. Almost done with this series. Okay, now probably isn't the time, but I suddenly get curious of like what Life is Strange has planned in the future. Gotta have something, right? True Colors is so good. Uh, I have awakened. AJ's nowhere to be found? Okay. Oh, there he is, Norman. Made you some coffee. Oh, thanks, kid. It was in the kitchen. Tin said that I can have some. I didn't steal it. So we're gonna have to have a talk with you about, um, terms of surrender. <laughs> <laughs> kind of I'm shot another man in the head. We haven't had coffee in a long time. You put it in hot water. You're right. Thanks. Last night, with Marlin, 
I heard Lewis and, and what he called me. Am I a murderer? Yeah? Yeah, kinda. No! Oh my god! Shit! We could get medicine from the nurse's office. Dude, what? <laughs> <laughs> He's got a fucking hole straight from the back of his head to the front. You want to go get some medicine? Hold on. <laughs> Ain't no medicine curing that. His brain's out. You shot him. He's dead. You're a murderer. You promised Marlin. You said you'd help him fix things. What the fuck did you teach this kid? Well, see, we watched Avengers Infinity War a few two times, and he learned to always aim for the head. He called me a murderer. But, but we're supposed to kill bad stuff. Monsters. Did I do it bad? I thought Marlin was bad. He killed Brody. He, he kept telling I'm lies. I'm not. <laughs> I was going to stay silent. <laughs> please just tell me. If I'm a murderer, I, I should know. Right? So. Alright, I'll, I'll be so honest with you. Try him. not to be your. I'll be honest. It's really hard to hear. Lewis was right. Sometimes people do bad things, like Marlin did. But when you shot him, he wasn't a threat to us anymore. If you kill someone when they're no longer threatening you, that's murder. Even if they were bad? I mean, legally, it's still murder yeah, either way. But not that wrong. law matters anymore. What are we gonna do? Back off, all of you! You talked Marlin down, and then they fucking murdered him! Take AJ, go inside. Come on, let's go. I, I appreciate Violet oh, taking this situation. Go back to the dorms? What happens the next time one of us does something this kid doesn't like? Should we expect a bullet too? That's not what happened. It's exactly what happened. Marlon started this. He killed Brody and almost got me too. AJ did what he had to do. What he had to? He didn't have to shoot Marlon in the fucking skull. Oh, I agree. I it agree. He over. didn't have to. Get it, Lewis. Just back off, okay? Back off? Seriously? I'm not just gonna offer the kid up to you, though. Let's go. Clem? Clem? If I'm a murderer, am I gonna die too? What? No. Well, I think murderers are like monsters, and I know what happens to monsters. Nothing good. Nothing good at all. We can forgive them. Murderers, even some monsters. They get a second chance. Some monsters, not all. When bad people, like murderers, try to make it right, that's when other okay. people okay. forget. I, I really hope AJ. That sounds hard. Yes, it does. It is. <laughs> We're going to fix this. Uh... You and me. I'm going to help you atone. Atone? It means make up for what you did wrong. We'll make it all right with the others. <laughs> For God's sake, someone help hey, me! Hey, what do you mean help you? He's dead! I saved you from that car wreck and you fucking murdered him? Get back, Mitch. Get back. Or what? You're gonna let him kill me too? Then who's next? A sim? Willie? Haven't enough people died tonight? Brody, Marlin, we can't keep killing each other. Oh, fuck, are you saying that to me after what he did? Screw both of you. Hey, what is it? You've killed a lot of people. You told me your friend Lee became a monster. But you didn't kill him. Well, I did. I clicked the wrong he thing. wasn't a threat. Is I, that why you didn't? I, I, did, I did kill him, though. I clicked the wrong thing whenever I was asking me what my choices were. Um. He didn't want me to. He said it would change me forever. 
But I know he... He became a monster. Do you wish you did? Yeah, every day. I'll at least be regretful about it. I love you, Clem. Oh, thanks, kid. I love you back. Oh. Hey, Ted. Hey. Violet said to come get you for the funeral. Really? We used to have them more. Then we stopped. It seems right, though. I brought you something. Some people won't agree, I imagine. For me? I figured you'd be afraid, with everyone all upset. But you were brave last night. Well, thanks. Like a firefighter. No. Firefighters are good. I'm a murderer. No, you're not. You gotta have a trial first. They Doesn't decide mean he's not a murderer. Courtroom. That's how it works. Er, worked before. Back then, there were all kinds of rules about who was innocent, who was guilty. Oh, I thought you meant at this place. We have to decide things for ourselves now. We can't rely on other people to make the rules for us. Who decided you're a murderer? I did. But she's right. So's everyone else. I think you're okay. Thanks, Ten. You sure you don't want your fire? Ten fire? condones you murder. Because you you're good, like him. But maybe we could play with him later? Together? Sure. After the funeral. They buried them already. Vile started soon. Okay. See you out there. This is gonna be hard. Everyone's going to be upset. We need to show them we care, okay? Okay. Do we need to, like, bring something? Or... Drink coffee. I need coffee. Flem can't operate without her morning juice. Can, can I drink more coffee? No, okay. <laughs> I would have lied if it just let me keep, just keep go. doing it. Soon. Uh, what am I doing first? I just look at everything. Yes, I can. At least these won't die. Oh, well, that's depressing. You said that loud enough for him to hear. That, that's just... They look good together. Do you think his is better? No, I like them both. All art is valid. Based Clem, right? All right, let's go. Ready? AJ is shaped. Oh, you teach him. Yeah, I know. So I'm trying to teach him that murder is bad. To regret his actions. As I should. Okay, calling this a run is, is charitable. did that. Yes, you did. Come on. Right now, let's just focus on what we're here to do. Okay?
Oh, God. They're here. So what? They knew Brody, didn't they? Yeah, but Marlin... Just leave them alone. <sighs> Shit. Clem? What? <clears throat> Why do people have funerals? Tin said they used to have them more if they died. Well, to say goodbye to someone you've lost. But they're dead. Oh, this is your last chance to see them before they're gone forever. I made them all sad. Like if someone took you away. Yes. Does everyone get a funeral? People do. Some animals, too. Even monsters? Whatever she says. Even monsters. Ten. You ready? Brody, you always said you wanted to go to the beach. So, I drew it for you. Marlin was... I can't. Not for Marlin. Oh, damn! After what he did to the twins and Brody, I... You didn't even like Brody! You were always mean to her. I can't. Someone else do it. Bitch. Dude, don't. Seriously, Lewis. He was your best friend. He wasn't perfect, but he deserved better than to get gunned down by that kid. AJ killed him like it was nothing. You're right, Mitch. Marlin didn't deserve what AJ did to him. I know what I did. I'm sorry. I know I'm a murderer. But I'm gonna, uh, uh... Atone. Yeah, atone it. Fuck, I can't listen to this. Well, damn. What I did was bad, and I'm gonna make it up to you. I promise. You don't have to make up shit. Marlin was a fucking murderer and a liar, and if we'd all asked more questions about Minnie and Sophie disappearing last year, none of this would have happened. She's got a point. Shut up! It wasn't Marlin's fault. Then whose fault was it? Violet's right. You all share responsibility for what happened to Sophie and Minnie. And to Okay, this sounds really judgmental coming from Clint, though. <laughs> but I'm also like, I don't want to keep harping on a on a AJ whenever he, he someone else is getting blanked thrown around. But it's also <laughs> it sounds so bad coming from Clem of all people to be like harping judgment. Who's responsible for that? I already said me. See what I mean? How can any of us trust these fucking people? What? what? Are you saying? That didn't prove anything. I'm saying they gotta fucking go. They take a vote. Majority decides. They stay or they leave. Today. That does seem fair. Are you serious? It's bullshit. You're bullshit. I don't want to leave, but if you all decide we should, we'll go. Clem, you heard her, kid. A vote's the only way to settle this, or we'll be arguing forever. Fine. I guess we're fucking voting. Lewis needs to vote. Could you go get him? And try to talk to him. Come on, Rosie. Come here, girl. Could you guys go wait in the dorm? I'll come get you. Okay. Sounds good to me. Please don't kick us out. Come on, let's go. I think we've got Violet's vote. We might even have Lewis too. I, I feel like he's really torn on the matter. Mitch definitely wants us gone. But he's also a minor character for what it's worth.
what are, what are we smacking? Oh, okay, he's kicking all the wall. AJ, I don't think destroying the place will help our case any. AJ, stop. You'll break your toe or something. Come here, sit down. No. It didn't work. I did what you said, and they didn't even care. Not gonna be that easy. I know that I was bad, but, but they don't want to let me fix it. Well, you can't AJ, force them. AJ, breathe. Remember what we do when we're mad? Come on. I don't want to be loud, do you? What do we do when we're mad? We stop and think and, um... I'm still really, really mad. I know that I'm not supposed to get mad or sad because then I do dumb things. And you have every reason to be upset. We'll deal with it together, okay? Okay. We stop, we think, and we breathe. Breathe. Tom is honestly, you know, for, for a kid, is really good at this. <laughs> You're still mad, huh? And, uh, I think I'm sad, too. I did what you told me to. I know. You're a good listener. I wanted to make them all feel better. It didn't work. It's gonna take a lot more Why time, a lot more work. It didn't work. We don't know that it didn't work. They might have voted for us to stay. I don't know. They seem pretty mad. Violet was on our side. Maybe she'll persuade the others. Yeah, maybe. I don't want to go. Yeah, we got Violet in ten, I think. I know you don't. I like knowing where we are all the time. The bed, the food. I like the other kids. Not all of them, but Tin and Lewis and Violet. You know, the, the characters that matter. Hey, guys. We took the vote. You have to leave. Don't we get to vote? I vote that we stay. That's not how it works. Maybe it should be. You don't have to like it. Good, because I don't. Fine. I get it. We'll learn to live with your decision somehow. Seriously? That's it? What? You know this is fucking wrong, and you're not going to fight it at all? Wait, what, what am I supposed to do? What's the point? I don't want to see her. already decided. Yes, we have. So fucking stupid. You said you'd go along with it, if we voted fairly. It's bullshit. And you'd know it if you weren't so used to burying your head in the sand. Oh, I'm burying my head in the sand? Hate Marlin all you want, but you can't tell me AJ isn't dangerous too. We'll wait for you to pack up, then Lewis and I'll escort you out past the safe zone. We'll make sure you get to the road safely. It's not a lot, but at least you won't die on the way. Thanks for making sure that we... No, don't thank them! It's, it's their fault we gotta leave! They're gonna get rid of us! Get him under control. AJ, breathe. Like, I, I can't blame them for kicking us out. We shot their leader. <laughs> Violet and AJ are being a little bit ridiculous about this. Because, like, there should be consequences. I get that. And they don't have to forgive us for, you know, shooting Marlin. Like, 
Where's Tim? I gotta say goodbye. He was really upset about the vote, and he's not talking to anybody. It's best to leave him alone when he's like this, but for the record, he wanted you to stay. Well, he'd be happy to see us then, right? Huh? Wait. Does AJ still have that gun? Hand it over. Is this necessary? Hell yes, it's necessary. Give it to him. Here, you can have it. Fuck. There. Happy? Can we go? <clears throat> I think we should say goodbye to ten first. Okay. I'm surprised Violet isn't saying fuck this place and leaving too, but I, I guess I kind of get it. She's loved these people for so long. Makes sense that she's dead. Also, like, she's clearly not happy with them. <laughs> um, before we go any further, I think I will stop there. I'll see you all next time at The Walking Dead Final Season, Episode 2. Bye. Thank you for watching. If you liked what you saw, please leave a like and comment and subscribe to the channel for more content. Thank you.